So now continuing on, still working a practice on a sitting in a chair, what I want you to do is cross your legs. Don't worry about getting any of these postures right. What I want you to work is work with the basic shape of the posture. Let your body breathe. Feel here, experience the range of your breath more than anything else. Uncross your legs, cross them the other way. And only when I'm comfortable, I do this a few more times. I work at my pace. I'm not going to do what others are doing or how others are doing it. I'm doing what I can. The next time I have kept my legs crossed, I stay right there. I open out my arms in a T and I just twist my body on either side three times. And as mindfully keeping my feet crossed or keeping my legs crossed, I start with called what we call the eagle posture. Garudasana. Now this posture is not just about getting your upper body, your shoulders, your biceps, your triceps, your heart muscles to become strong. It is also working your mind. There is a direct connection of this posture to your brain, making sure that I breathe. Two more times. It doesn't matter whether you get this posture the way I am doing it because it's always a breathing class. Keep those arms moving. Uncross your legs. Open out your arms in a T. Cross your legs the other way. Twist open to the walls on either side three times. Noticing right away that indeed there is a difference from my one leg to another not good not bad just different i start with my eagle postures notice the difference here again one leg crossed one leg more comfortable and as i do this eagle i feel the knots in my shoulders in my back, in my upper back, my lumbar back, my thoracic spine, everything loosen up. One last time, very mindfully, I uncross my feet. I lower all feet, four corners of my feet down. Inhale, I come up on my heels. Exhale, I press into my toes, I lift my heels. Inhale, I come up on my heels. And one last time, press into my toes, lift my heels. So now I work the entire body sitting down. Now all my movements are going to be standing up portion, but maybe for the next 20 seconds, we'll use the chair as well. Inhale, I stand up tall. I reach up with my arms. Exhale with balance and breath. I sit down. Inhale, I stand up tall. I reach up with my arms. Exhale, I sit down. And this time, inhale, I stand up tall. I reach up with my arms. Now everybody, this is the one posture that I want you to try to do every day. This is a posture that will help you open up every part of your body. So try to make sure that you're sitting down in a chair which is not on wheels because the chair might tend to slide sometimes. That's very, very important. Now we're going to do postures of standing up. So what I want you to do is separate your feet slightly. Just rotate those hips. Every one of my endocrine glands are beginning to move and then rotate your hips in this opposite direction. And notice even in this one, that you're a lot more flexible in this side rotation or is that other side rotation. And then just sway those hips side to side. Just having fun. 
but at the same time working those muscles it's like doing that zumba dance but still having fun and still feeling every body work every muscle work now open out your arms in a d and just sway or twist your body side to side working at what i can do not what i did yesterday or not what someone else is doing working at my pace and as i do this one last time checking in with my breath i bring my arms by my side i just close my eyes long enough to notice am i breathing my full range of breathing my lungs filling up my lungs emptying out relaxed on my feet inhale i circle my arms up to the sky exhale i pretend to sit down in a chair behind me but i'm not actually sitting down i just bend my knees my arms go back that ski movement like i'm ready to ski inhale i stand up tall exhale i ski back inhale i stand up tall exhale that ski movement one last time inhale i stand up tall and as i bend my knees my arms are back i keep my knees bent inhale i reach forward exhale i reach back inhale i reach forward exhale i reach back one last time i hold my arms forward i reach forward now i keep my left hand where it is i twist open to my right i come back to the center i twist open to my left one more time center i twist open to my right center i twist open to my left i come back to the center my knees are still bent i take all four both hands making sure that my fingers are turned on the inside of my thighs i my hands come just above my knees i rotate my knees in this direction maybe 3 to 4 times and then in that opposite direction 3 to 4 times always remembering that this is about my breath one last time on this side and one last time on the other side slowly stand up tall inhale i reach up i identify my right hand i slide that right hand down i lean to my right inhale i stand up tall i slide my left arm down and i lean to my left one of the often asked questions when i teach a senior class is about feeling bloated feel being feeling constipated so these are the postures that will help you so the next time your arms reach up slide your right arm down lean to your right feel that left side of your body open up first now take that same right hand pat that right knee so you know it's your right hand take that right hand and wrap it around your left hip and turn like you're looking over your right shoulder come back to the center slide your left arm down lean to your left and then pat your left leg so you know it's your left or left arm and your left leg now take that left arm left hand wrap it around your right hip and turn like you're looking over your left shoulder inhale deep exhale bring those arms by your side breathing as i do this very mindfully bring your hands to your waist and just turn twist on either side and as i do this one last time breathing as i do this slowly come back to the center 